At the meeting, Hompa Alphonse Kawundu reminded the aggrieved villagers that the Communal Land Act does not allow him to allocate land without the consent of the residents. Kaundu accused villagers of approaching his office to approve land applications before consulting each other widely. Kaundu said once villagers confirm that they welcomed a land applicant, he has no right to deny anyone access to land. What I sense here is that people here were not consulted before fencing started. Because people who live in an area are the ones who are supposed to measure for you the land they are willing to give you. If you are new, you accept what they give you. A headman from Sitenda village, Osiro Manyondo, says it was unfortunate that procedures were not followed when the land in question was allocated to Kashkola. Manyondo advised the Kashkola to remove the fence and vacate the disputed land. I know he is not a difficult person. I will inform him myself to speak to his workers to stop fencing because people are not happy. He will stop. The villagers say the land is reserved for grazing and the alleged illegal fence cuts them off from their crop fields. They vowed to remove the fence if the deputy minister does not do so himself. Our lives and those of our children depend on this land. If today it becomes someone's farm, where are we going to survive? Where are our cattle going to survive? They are fencing in our crop fields. Where are our children going to cultivate? This is our grazing land.